Hello. I'll try to make this brief, as I know that many of you have important places to go. I know you were expecting the president to address some of the critiques you've leveled at his job creation initiative today. Unfortunately, some information has come to our attention that makes it, well, hard to give a shit. Sorry, what did you say? I know, I know, I know. Murmur, murmur, murmur. Come on, just be quiet while I ruin you. We're all aware that newspaper circulation has been critically low, but our theory that no one at all was actually reading your work started in May when the New York Times turned what might be the best news story of the decade into the longest, most awkward headline in the history of run-on sentences. But you probably assumed, like us, that someone was reading your reporting. Otherwise, why are we here, right? Turns out the proper answer to those questions is someone is not, and we're not quite sure, actually. So this is what people do with their newspapers slash your livelihood, all right? Homeless insulation, blankets, forts, functional illiterates using it to show off. See, he's holding it upside down. Kindling, kill flies, and the percentage of people actually reading your newspapers? Zero, guys, zero. Of course, under the rights afforded to you by the Constitution, you can continue reporting. I just want to let you know as a courtesy that from this point on, we'll just be, you know, We'll be making shit up. Yeah. Also, uh, instead of Press Secretary Carney, you will be meeting with me, Press Secretary Carney's daughter, Melissa. And I will also be wearing pajama pants. What? I what? So, I'm sure you guys have a lot of questions for the president, but I just want to remind you that effective immediately, you are unemployed hobbyists, and he is the fucking president of the United States. But I'll stand here and look at you while you whine. Yes, Madeline. Jim? Is that your question? No, this, this is absurd. You don't do that. Stop that. Stop doing that. Stop what? You're making an obscene gesture, and you started the second I started talking. You're still doing it. This is New York Times. <laughs> Great question, Maddie. Still Jim. Maddie, I'm sure your readers will and so on. Great, I just wanted to, uh, in closing, say live from New York! It's... Just kidding. Fuck you. Get the fuck out. Come on, we're done. I got shit to do, folks. Skedaddle. Skadoot. Skadida. <laughs> Who won't the Republic is safe? I'm so high.